Ito Shinsui was born in Tokyo in 1898 during a period of intense cultural and social transformation. Many Japanese artists of those years were already forming following the modern methods of Western style art. However, Shinsui was educated according to the traditional master discipline relationship. At 13, he was accepted as a student by Kaburagi Kyokata from 1878 to 1972, one of the most distinguished painters of his time, showing the young Shinrui a prodigious talent that earned him to participate in private exhibitions, receiving awards and prizes. In 1915, the publisher Watanabe Shosaburo discovered a female portrait of him in a collective exhibition. Fascinated by the work, he addressed the young artist through his teacher to propose to turn painting into a creation for a print. In front of the mirror, which appeared the following year, marked the beginning of the fruitful collaboration for 40 years. The first prints of Shinsui already announces where his prolific career as an artist of the Shin Hanga will point. More than two-thirds of her prints are framed in the genre of beautiful woman's portrait and are characterized by technical perfection. Following the tradition of the Bejinga, women are shown through the eyes of a male observer, not visible in the image, and are portrayed in a domestic environment in the course of activities considered as feminine. Shinsu's the mood beauties were the perfect visualization of traditional Japanese femininity. In his last years of life, Shinsui went beyond the conventions of the Bijinga using modern means of expression to capture both, the personality of the model portrayed as the pulse of contemporary everyday life. The most outstanding improvement of his post-war painting is precisely in the portrait, both the individual and the collective. In 1952, he received the title of Preserver of the Intangible Cultural Properties, and in 1970, he was awarded the third degree of the Order of the Rising Sun. He died in 1972, at the age of 74, only two months after his teacher. Until the end of his life, his motivation and creativity did not wane, nor did his efforts to innovate from tradition. Ito Shinsui dies in 1972.